Representative Rob Bishop is hosting this job and resource fair for local veterans. It's all about giving back to those who put our country first. The transition from combat to civilian life isn't an easy one. Richard Waldo served in the Air Force during Desert Storm. He knows when you come home, it doesn't mean the battle is over. You don't feel like you're part of the community. Uh, if you have PTSD like I do, uh, you hide away from the public and uh, you, you just don't feel like you belong. Waldo is not alone. Many servicemen and women struggle with employment, relationships, and mental health when they return. We too often see veterans uh, who do struggle at that point in their lives as they're making that transition from military uh, to civilian life. But there's terrific programs that are available that they've earned by virtue of their military service. That's where Representative Bishop's Veterans Resource and Education Fair comes in. It brings employment, education, health services, and much more all together under one roof. So the veterans can come here and see what options are open to them, but also so these agencies can see what other options are out there. Some of them are learning what's actually available so they can refer veterans when they come to them to their agency. Bishop says it's the least he can do for those in his district who were willing to put it all on the line to defend our freedom. And these people made their first commitment to make my life more secure and my family safer and better. We want to see if we can pay back in some way. People like Waldo, who has found new hope through accepting help. It's really made a difference in my life. Um, and I encourage other veterans to do the same. Uh, don't sit at home and say, I don't want anything from the government. I don't want any help. Um, get the help you need. If you or anyone you know could benefit from the services offered at today's job fair, you can contact Representative Bishop's office or the Department of Veterans and Military Affairs. We have that contact information posted for you on our website, goodforutah.com. Reporting in Ogden, I'm Glenn Mills. All right, Glenn, thank you very much. I think I have my voice back.